Yo, 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 this is Games and Graphics. We're back at the building with another GTA 5 mod tutorial for you. And today we are going to be installing the Payday. It's a single player heist mod, all right? This is where we get to play uh, some single player heist in single player mode, all right? We're gonna be able to use um, Franklin, Mike, and Trevor, all right? Um, I always urge everybody to read the description that the author has on the download page before you download any mod <clears throat> or script. He also will let you know um, what recommended mods you can download with this as well. And um, also he has the requirements for this, all right, which is scripthookv and scripthookv.net and native UI, all right. I will have a link down in the description to a video showing you how to install all three, all right. Um, now we are going to need this of course and also we are going to need open all interiors okay so i'm gonna have those links down in the description as well and also i'm gonna have a link to simple trainer it's a mod menu we are going to need simple trainer for this also okay um it's going to be real quick but we're still going to need simple trainer so make sure you check out the links in the description um it's very important that you watch those and have everything installed correctly okay so we are going to install um we're going to download payday single player heist mod and download open all interiors and once you have those downloaded it should look something like this right here inside of this folder on the left i have the two um, mods and scripts that we just downloaded the first one right here is open all interiors and then i have the payday okay as you can see they are in compressed files so you will need a program to unzip compressed files either 7-zip or winwar okay i'm just going to go ahead and unzip these real quick there we go now i could go ahead and delete the compressed files all right now on the right hand side i have grand theft auto 5 directory opened up right here on my right hand side we are going to go back to our downloads and open up the open all interiors folder and inside that folder is going to have three files in the readme we are going to only take the very uh, the first two files okay so you're going to take these two files that i have highlighted open interiors asi file and open interiors configuration settings you want to take those two drag and drop those right into our grand theft photo 5 directory okay just like how you see it right here now let's go back over to our downloads and open up the payday folder all right and open up the second folder that's inside there and you should see three files right here okay now let's go back to our grand theft photo 5 directory and we want to open up our scripts folder if you don't have one create a new folder and name it scripts and make sure to put your native ui inside of the scripts folder all right once we have that all set let's go ahead and go back to our payday folder let's go ahead and highlight all three of these files drag and drop these into our scripts folder just like so all right now once we have that all done we can go ahead and minimize out these windows and run the game all right once you load into the game what you want to do is open up your uh, menu right here and you will see um, houses. You, you will see like these little icons right here. Spread it throughout the map. These are actual interiors that you can enter into right here. They'll be all around the map, okay? And if you come over here, you will see there is a HS, all right? This is the heist. This is over at uh, Lester's office. This is where we have to make our way to in order to start the heist. So I'm just gonna make a little way way there. And before we even do that, let's open up our uh, simple trainer menu. And what we need to do is go down to teleporting and then go all the way down to the bottom where it says other teleports. 
and now we want to scroll down to enable MP maps okay you want to select that and now MP maps are enabled okay um, let me go ahead and change the weather a little bit there we go and I'm gonna teleport over to Lester's office okay we are right here at Lester's office So what we want to do is run on down here and we want to enter inside Lester's office. All right, once inside, we want to go over to here, I believe, in here. And as soon as we come inside, it's going to give us instructions at the top left of the screen to open the heist menu. And then the uh, menu will open up. It'll let you know by either pressing right on the controller on the D-pad or press E on your keyboard. And we want to select heist. And select heist. And we have the option to select a different heist, okay? Now, all each one of these heists have uh, setups. It's just like the online heist, how we have to do the setups before we do the finale. So this is the same thing, okay? Um, I'm gonna go ahead and check the Felisa heist. Starting, continuing heist, Felisa job, okay? It says choose location. Uh, choose location, click on locations. And, okay, location is the Felisa bank also, okay? And then we can click start. All right, go take a look at the bank so we now know what we are dealing with and then we can start planning this out, okay? That's what it says right there. All right, so as you can see, that's our little circle right there. So they said we they want us to go and check out the bank. Now let's go ahead and leave out Lester's office. If we open up our pause menu and open up the map, you can see there is already a GPS leading to the bank that we need to go check out. All right. So all we need right now is a car to go check out the bank. Let me just go ahead and spawn a vehicle in. Uh, no, I meant to go to muscle. There we go. All right. So let's go ahead and follow that GPS to the marker, which is at the bank. And as you can see, if you look across on the left hand side, there will be a red circle letting us know that is where we need to go. And that is the Fleece Bank right there. All right, Lester says, okay, looks like it's a small hit. Let me see what kind of response we get from the cop. All right. Okay. Oh, wow. You see how the police got here? Uh, okay, not bad of a response time. Head back to the factory. Okay. What the hell? What the hell is wrong with that damn cop, man? Crackheaded ass cop. Yeah, watch out, lady. Damn, he just knocking shit over, huh? Look, look at his ass. All right, anyway, we gotta make our way back down to Lester's. It shouldn't be hard because we came straight down the street, right? I think, did we? Yeah, we did. Okay. So we're gonna go back down to Lester's. Um, there we go. Oh, let me save this car so it doesn't despawn on me. Alright, save vehicle. Okay. Now we're gonna get back park right here and Lester says okay good we can start planning out the heist mission complete all right so when you get the mission complete you just want to park your car and uh, run inside and we're gonna go right back in that office all right
right? Because these are just the setups. Okay, so come over here and access the menu again. Okay, we need a. Okay, we will need a jackhammer, uh, a jammer for the heist. Luckily, there is one at the police station nearby. Okay, so we just got our instructions to go to the police station and pick up something. Now, as soon as we get in our car, there should be a GPS already uh, tracing our destination. Yep, and as you can see, it is on my mini map. We have a GPS already tracking the destination. So let's go ahead and get to it. It's at the police station, so the police station should be uh, this police station that's right over this hill, actually. Yes, I mean not the hill, but right over the bridge. All right. So, um, by following the GPS marker. Just park the car right here. I guess we're gonna run up through here. So we're going all the way inside the police station? Ah. a red mark okay that's a red mark where we have to go Lester says okay good you have got the jammer return to the factory okay let's uh, go out the same way we came don't want to see no police let me hear them get the hell up out of here all right there we go and let's hear and get up out of here All right, we are good to go. Let's go ahead and head back over the bridge and go back to Lester's. Whoa, watch it, buddy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bite me. <laughs> like my shorts say. <laughs> circle it says okay good we could get a getaway vehicle now mission complete all right so once we get that mission complete we're gonna go ahead and run back inside Lester's we're gonna go back in that same office that's to the left in the back as soon as we get inside the office we will press right on the d-pad or E on the keyboard and then select heist select heist again and then select the same heist that we've been doing. All right. Now Lester says, okay, we will either need to source a Karuma or a insurgent. All right. So now we have our, um, our instructions. Now we have to go ahead and source those cars. All right. Now that we are inside the car, we have our uh, we have our GPS set on our mini map. Mm, it's not too far. It's pretty close, so we're just gonna keep driving all the way there. Oh, just missed the police. Up, uh, up, uh, up, uh, up. Uh. To run some red lights. I don't know if we're exactly timed. It doesn't look like it because I don't see a timer. Oh, I just passed a turn. Oh my gosh. Okay, hold on, hold on. I just I see hella red dots on my map. Gotta make sure I got some weapons back here. 
Okay, give all weapons. All right, all weapons added. Let's do uh, no reload and unlimited ammo. That's right, folks. I like to cheat. <laughs> all right. Um, I think we're yeah. I think they're all up here. Let me. I should do this smart, huh? Let's do this. Oops. Park my car right around here. I'm get out my favorite weapon, the Combat MG MK2. You know. Let me see what I'm working with. Oh wow, look at that! There's a lot of people up here. What the hell are they doing? Okay, so well they got the car I need. Well, shoot away. Hey, come on, man. Where do you think he going? I ain't leave no money for you, boy, huh? Okay. All right, okay, good. You have got the Karuma. Bring it back to the factory for safekeeping. Okay. Guess I'll just leave my little card right there in the cut. Oh, damn. Say it for safekeeping, man. He didn't say damage it. <laughs> they said bring it back to the factory. Safekeeping. I don't know why is it still on there like that. But he said bring it back to the factory, so that's what we're gonna do. Even though the GPS still says there's uh, a bunch of bad people up there, but we killed all the bad people. So, we're going to do like Lester said and bring this bad boy back to the factory. Alright, and there goes our red circle. Alright, there we go. Lester said, okay, good. We can finally move on the bank. Goody, 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 goody. Alright, now that we got that mission complete, you know what's next. We go upstairs inside the warehouse, go to the back office, press right on the D-pad or E on the keyboard, select heist, select heist again, select the heist that we've been doing. Alright, start continuing heist, police job. Alright, it says start heist and we got crew set up. So let's select the crew by selecting crew set up. Now we could go down and select the hacker level. I want to select uh, semi-pro. Let's do that. Teammate one, no AI, or we can have an AI. All right, let's have a, a AI. Teammate one skill, um, unbeatable, I like that. And let's do another teammate, and let's have them be uh, a juggernaut. All right, and let's have one, a third one also. And let's have him be a pro. All right. I think that's it. Okay, crew cut is a million. Um, wow, that's a lot. A million six hundred fifteen thousand five hundred. All right. Um, yeah, that'll work. And start. Right. Okay. Once we are done, um, you know, configuring everything out, and just go ahead and select start. Lester says, okay, it is time to move on the bank. Get in the armor, Karuma, and place the jammer on the vault door. Okay. And place the jammer on the vault door. Okay, and here goes my backup. That's one of them right there. That's two of them right there. And the third one, I believe, had walked in the wrong office. Excuse me. Yeah, he's right there. That's the juggernaut. All right. All right, y'all, come on, let's go. All right, now we're all gonna have to jump inside the Karuma right here. And here comes my team members. They're going to hop inside the Karuma with me. All right. So it's pretty cool, you know, when you do uh, the heist. I think this is the finale also, folks, so, um, we get to have like a nice little crew with this to run the finale, all right? And I'm pretty sure that there's a way that you could tweak that if you wanted them to be add-ons or something like that. I'm pretty sure that's possible as well. Just having uh, played with that part myself. 
but I'm pretty sure it's possible. There's a will, there is a way. Oh, 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 oh excuse me. I right, want to keep a low profile. So we robbed this bank right here. Let me make sure that uh, we got the time nice and right. Uh, weather's good. Okay, there we go. All right, y'all. The bank's right there. I'm gonna go down and bucket Yui. We are going to park in front of this Jeep. Yeah, because we're going to run and jump right up in here, and I don't need nobody blocking us. All right, come on, y'all. And yep, let's go, let's go, let's go. Didn't it say collect something? The jammer? We just go in here and start robbing it. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay, time until vault opens up. All right, everything cool out there? We just gotta wait a little time until it opens up. No police coming? Oh, man, this is wonderful, y'all. We doing good, fellas. Oh, uh, we finna eat nice tonight, man. No lobsters and shrimps and all that good old shit. Y'all eat seafood? I love seafood, man. Oh, man. We gonna be eating good tonight, man. You know what I mean? Oh yeah. So hey man, uh, how's the family doing, huh? Everybody's doing good. The wife, kids, and everybody. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. What about you, my man? Uh, didn't you get your name. I just called you number two. That's that's number three over there. Uh, enough of the small talk. It should be time for this door to open up so we can get to our million dollars. Here we go. And look at that, folks. By the time the counter stops, by the time the... Okay, Lester said, okay, head to the vault to grab the money. Like I was saying, uh, by the time the, the timer stops, load up as much as you can and head to the getaway car and escape cops. Okay, I guess I'm loading up right now. Go to the factory to get the money.
I ain't scared of you motherfuckers.